Hi, I'm Todd Henderson. Today I want to give you a quick tech tip on how to replace the twist clamp on the front side of a Gator trifold or hybrid cover. Now, there's a couple of different reasons why though they'll fail. Uh, if it is shoved up inside the bracket and twisted, uh, sometimes it'll, it'll strip out this top portion. Um, or if it's over tightened, it can also strip out the top portion. So this is how you're going to fix that. Typically, if you need to replace a turn clamp is because this shaft up at the top where it mounts uh, to the bracket up top has been stripped out. And so when you try to loosen it up, the whole shaft spins. Well, if, you, if the whole shaft is spinning, that means you can't lower it down, you cannot remove it from the truck. So to get it off the truck, what you're going to need to do is first get a pair of vice grips, grab a hold of uh, the shaft with the vice grips, and then hold vice grips still while you turn the twist clamp. Okay, so now what you're going to want to do is twist this until it comes completely off. Once that's off, you can go ahead and release the, uh, the vice grip. Now you can go ahead and lift up the cover. Now you this, this shaft, you can bring it kind of sideways and slide it in between uh, the bracket and the tarp. And slide it right out. This is the only portion that really needs to be replaced. The replacement that you're sent is a complete assembly. You've got the bracket, you got the shaft, you got the jaw, you got everything you need. Um, so what you want to do is you want to disassemble that. Then take out your new shaft. Once the new shaft has been pulled out, there again, lift up the cover again. Run your new shaft back through. You want to turn that to where the head of the shaft drops down into the frame of that bracket. Once that's in place, take your new jaw and your uh, new twist. Slide that in place and reassemble it. What you want to do is make sure that as you're twisting this, you kind of pull down on it at the same time. Uh, the reason why this shaft a lot of times uh, can fail or what can cause it to fail is if it's pushed up and it gets caught uh, inside the frame and then it can uh, get stripped loose and then strip the inside of that, then it just spins. There's nothing holding it in place. So keep kind of pulling down on it while you turn uh, the, the twist clamp. Now you never need to over tighten that, just get it to where it's snug, where it draws down on the, on the cover. Once it's in that position, that's all you need to do. If you try to over tighten it, that can also strip out that shaft. Well that concludes your tech tip. If you have any questions, call the experts, we're here to help you out.